Bass Rusty on a Possum Bayou channel. I just wanted to do a quick video to kind of start to finish up this DPM build I started doing months ago. Uh, like I said in one of the videos, my father was sick. He passed away uh, the Saturday before Mother's Day. So I've been kind of in and out and frustrated getting this layout stuff going on and trying to think about doing this video. So I just did the video. Do that. I got this I'm going to say in a video, I've ordered some, some flex track, about 12 pieces of microengineering flex track. I'm going to put in whenever I get it in. But this is going to finish up that little building. I've done some paint work to it. Show a little bit of what i got going on, a little bit of weather, a little bit of washes on it. So just watch the video and enjoy it. I'm going to show you what I've been doing with this wash. I had my little camera, then I had this thing, and I forgot to put the record button. Here's a wash I had made some with some white and black paint there and some mineral spirits, but just like any other wash, you kind of, you got a little bit too much, you can just kind of spread it around. And you can see I've already done some of this. Like I said, I've done, spent some time on a, with a little camera. Yeah, and, and these little things right here is basically these windows and this DP kit or you have to hand paint those you can see that's very <laughs> tedious it can be a real pain in the rear like I was saying in the intro I had dropped this and this back wall fell off which it's not as together as it once was but I'm not so sure that super glue was the right thing maybe some other type of cement Maybe somebody can leave the information in the comments. Mm. Just, I said it's wash. It's just what it is. Just washing pigments. I hear my cat back there. I don't know if you heard her or hear her, but she's wanting something. No telling about a cat. And just all the wash it way you so I got a little bit of that green paint on there. I'm gonna do a little touch up, do a little extra wash. That's probably a little DPM kit, just a little bit. And that's me old wash on the window sills there a little bit. That I've already a little bit of a wash and let her dry and I got some of these little details right here got my little Toastmasters thing that I do I got the head speaker that night at our little meeting uh, I do get up in front of crowds and do some talking sometimes I have to do every once in a while I do some big time presentations for work sometimes but but what I want to do is paint these. I'm going to do a wash. That one looks like it may have a little bit of paint on it, but it still needs a little flash clean up. And put some of these on top of here. Now, as you see, I put some patchwork and a little bit of thick black paint on there. And I did happen to get wash on here right there I don't want to pick that brush up but yeah okay just a matter just put some of the water on there let it dry, get the wash. I'll paint these or something and do a wash to bring out the details on them. Basically, these are out of uh, some other pieces out of some kits I had, but for the most part, they're out of the Walther's in scale rooftop details kit. So, we'll check the next few clips where I do that. Now here's that dock I was, I was saying I had put a 
glued it with super glue and dropped it and it all kind of come apart but not too bad but you can start to see a little bit of the the lines between the pieces of concrete got some a little bit of wash on there it's already dried I wanted to show that real quick boy I got off into something else okay here well drop that but anyway this is kind of how this thing is going after I done some washes to this thing I put on another layer of the dull coat and to make it work now got this little air conditioner unit piece and a couple of these vents over here ah, there we go it is maybe okay there there's about where I'm going to put them in a minute. I'm going to glue them in place. I'm going to use some silicone glue, some silicone caulk like stuff I have. Just because I have it here, I don't feel like going and getting anything else. All right, here in a minute. What I'm going to do is put a little dab of this in here, get this started. Not going to take much. Steady it there. I'm just doing this for enough. For these things to stay and put a little in here. I'll use maybe something else. Yeah. Just going to hit just a little dab of this stuff on the corners. Put this in there. Now then. That's some of the roof detail stuff that's on there. I'm going to finish this little dude up. And yeah, it looks pretty good. It actually doesn't look all that bad when I'm done with it. Go to the other room and get the Here it is, I just set it here on the layout and get that thing straightened back up. Here it is, sitting on the layout with a box car in front of it. And there we go, I'll just put it right there, even though that's not where I'm going to have it, just to show. Yeah, these don't look too bad once you get them started. Or finished. Now, that, that's, that dock's not it, but if you look under there, you can see... Remember some of the other videos, I had wrote numbers so I could keep track of what goes where. Now here's a little section of this layout. Here it looks like a mess. I still got some more to do. I got some track ordered. That thing there actually goes there. That building right there goes right here normally. That's what I plan on maybe to do. But I got some flex track ordered and I'll have some more videos coming out pretty soon. Maybe what I'm going to do with this, I don't know. Like I got track to do. I may do a video on how I painted those little rooftop details. It's not that big a deal, but it's, yeah, just a little paint and then a little paint over spray just to make it look a little, a little age to it. All right. Thank you. Well, there's my little short video. I just wanted to kind of get back into YouTube flow of things. I'm going to start working on my layout here a little bit. And like I said, it got some track coming in. Gonna be a little busy with that. I may show some stuff I'm doing with that. I may just give a quick layout update whenever I get my layout room here cleaned up again. It seems like I clean up and then I get a house projects going on the rest of the house. 
and this kind of ends up being my staging area from material and tools to do flooring in the kitchen or the bathroom or whatever. So until the next video, stay safe, people. <laughs>